Achieving a diagnosis of scleroderma is often long and difficult. It's a rare disease and during the early stages, which can drag on for months and years, it may resemble other connective tissue diseases. The initial symptoms may be vague, such as fatigue and cold hands, which can cause the doctors and patients to wrongly assume that the symptoms are psychosomatic. Some doctors shy away from diagnosing scleroderma, arguing that as there is no cure and no treatment specifically for it, there is no benefit in labelling it. Also, in the early stages, one diagnosis may replace another. It's nerve-wracking not knowing for sure what's wrong with us. We think we need a proper diagnosis to get proper care. And it also becomes a battle for self-esteem, to reassure ourselves and others that there really is something wrong with us. If you have queries about diagnosis of scleroderma, please see our list of scleroderma experts, the link for which is on our homepage.